Hello, this is Eric at the Prince George Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter, and we're taking a look at the 2011 Ford F-150 in a Lariat trim and powered by a 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost engine, providing you with plenty of power and great fuel efficiency, and also coming with heavy-duty mud flaps on the front and rear tires, running boards down below, and a soft top tonneau cover on the back to keep your belongings uh, dry and protected from the elements. But let's take a look inside. So first looking at the back where you have spacious seating for three with a nice uh, beige cream colored leather interior and the seats can be folded completely up and out of the way to accommodate any other cargo and you do have these nice weather tech floor mats throughout the vehicle and in the center you have another fold out armrest with two cup holders as well as two more cup holders right there as well as a 110 volt and a 12 volt power outlet. Now before we look in the front, I should mention this truck does also have a remote start, so no need to go outside on those cold mornings to warm up your truck. But looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as a fully power adjustable driver's seat with two memory buttons for your driver's seat, pedals, and I believe also your mirrors. So now sitting in the truck with it running, you can see that it's sitting at 195,000 and 309 kilometers, but moving down to the steering wheel, on the right-hand side, you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, and on the left-hand side, you have your cruise control buttons, as well as your controls for your little center screen here, where you can cycle through things such as your, uh, I believe this is customizable, what displays here, but your gauges, your trip A and B stats, your fuel economy, truck apps such as your off-road status and trailer status, settings for features around your truck, and information such as warnings and your my key. But moving on to your center, your infotainment center, which is radio, Sirius, CD, auxiliary, Bluetooth, and I believe also USB, so you do have quite a few options there for whatever you want to listen to, however you want to listen to it. Um, shifting into reverse, you do also have a backup camera with rear sensors that appears up here, so you're hopefully going to be able to avoid hitting anything. And uh, Moving down from that, you have all of your physical media controls here and your physical climate controls with dual climate and heated and air conditioned front seats, so you can really customize how comfortable you want to be. Uh, to the left of that, you have your 4x4 controls with a locking rear diff as well as your trailer brake underneath that. And over here, you have a 12 volt as well as a cubby beneath that. Then moving down, you have another 12 volt here with a cigarette lighter, but that doesn't mean it's been used or smoked in, I should say. And you have an auxiliary and USB here, so you can plug something in to either power or um, play your music that way. Then you have a cubby here, two cup holders, and your main shifter with select shift on the side, so you can manually shift through your gears. Also have this uh, pleasant looking wood grain all throughout the vehicle. But moving on to your center locking compartment slash armrest here, which is pretty spacious and has another 12 volt power outlet inside. Then finally looking back, you do also have a sliding rear window, if that's something that interests you. And finally, a uh, sunroof up top so you can let in the sunshine. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day.